Hey everyone, episode 77 part 1 finally came out with some plot twists after 3 weeks of waiting. In this video I will answer some questions from this episode, does everybody approve that we are friends with the toilets or some approve and some don't, are we finally going to see Titan Speakerman in part 2, will we finally see G-Man in part 3 and TV Titan. And also, I've noticed some parasite controlling the Astro's head. I will talk about it later in the video, trust me, you will be shocked. And most importantly, how many humans actually survived in the invasion? Anyways, let's get to the video. Let's go. Our scene starts with the POV of upgraded large cameraman from episode 76, and by the way, I think this is the ruins from episode 76. Large cameraman and mech cameraman must have flew and hid here after the battle occurred. They are currently hiding underwater right now. And notice this weird flying object here, it's probably an astro. We finally get out of the water and we discover that the city has changed so much. We tell mech cameraman and camera strider to stay underwater and finally get to the ruined city. This is the bridge that the cart toilet and 76 POV driven off from. The episode 76 POV and everyone that boarded the cart toilet's wing were all last seen dead way over there where the bridge led to. We look here and by the way, notice the mystery chair that we saw in one of the leaks over there, we notice it and fly towards it and then get distracted by the human saying. Don't shoot, we're not enemy. I've seen likes of you helping out other people. Can you get us to a safer place? No, can't you see? The church is on fire. We encounter the Astros trying to kill us, we shoot one of the Astro troops and then try to deal with the second one, it takes time to shoot and defeat it, and the humans are dead. Alright humans you can come now, oh well they're dead. Yeah, they're 100% dead. We notice an astro flying and stop for a moment, we get ready to shoot and then an astro comes out of nowhere. Jump scare. We block it off with our shield and try to shoot him. He is too dangerous and immortal that we can't take him on our own so one of the G squad members comes and saves us. The first one to come is a mutant that survived for over 10 episodes. And he's a mutant from the G-Squad. Another mutant appears, shooting the Astro, and then the Gigacad mutant handles the final blow, counting as the death of the Astro. And then POV still thinks they are evil, so the toilets say, Who is aiming at me? Is he stupid? We saved your life. Relax. We ain't here to hurt. Time for us to become friends, officially. We are not asking. The mutant aims for an X-Wing Astro and tries to shoot him. Two Astro troops join him as they all charge straight at us and the G-Squad. We all try to shoot the X-Wing Astro and struggle too much but upgraded DJ Toilet comes and finishes him. Mech cameraman and Strider comes to help and finish him, the Astro falls down and then Michael Jackson comes and finished him and cut his head off. His head falls out and somehow grows spider legs, I think the reason the Astros betrayed the Skibidi toilets is because they were infected mysteriously. I will get to that later. The Astro head roars at us, we try to stop him but he is too strong so Gigacad mutant comes and flings him off like a true Sigma Chad, causing the finish him moment. We look at him and finally accept that we teamed up with Toilets and G-Squad. 